as a parallel, we are um, we're doing extended reality for enterprises. So what that means is that we are virtual reality experts, mixed reality experts. So extended reality, basically every alternative reality there is, VR, AR, exactly. everything. Correct, yes. Okay, um, um, for enterprises. Now, why do they need this? Well, for a variety of different purposes. So in the first place, we started as a company who provided virtual reality solution for real estate company um, for their off-plan development project. So that was basically, they wanted to improve their sales process and they used virtual reality to demonstrate off-plan development side to their customers. Yeah, so you can you know, hold up the phone and see what the, the apartment looks like and stuff like uh, that. More to that. So yeah. you've, you've got um, a headset on, which puts you into this immersive environment. So you can literally see in a one-to-one -one ratio how this building is going to look like, what's the height of the ceilings in your future apartment, what's the view is going to be like, this kind of stuff. Um, so it helped them to improve their sales processes, to improve their KPIs, etc. And then we took it to the next level. We actually started putting different scenarios into the environments that we create. And this way, we started providing training solutions to all sorts of different corporates. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. And you have what's the competitive environment look, look like? Well, there are a lot of companies out there uh, which are providing the same kind of services that we do. What uh, do you think is your edge? The main um, products that we have developed, and the reason why we're here at TechCrunch, is a hardware device that we have developed. It's called NeuroGadget. So basically, mm. if you think about virtual reality on its own, it allows you to collect data from the headset. So you can tell where the person is looking at, um, how much they have been, how many, how much times they have been looking at a particular place, what the reaction is. Um, uh -huh. So this is a great data source. We took right. it to the next level. Uh, and we decided to, if you think about virtual reality, it creates an isolated environment Yes. where your full attention is focused on this environment. Yes. And if you measure your brainwave activity, you can tell whether the person is liking something or not within the, that environment or not. Whether the person is focused in that environment, whether the person is disliking something. 